Chrome Alert. Alert. Chrome Alert. 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 Today is NBA King David. Make sure y'all go follow him on Instagram. Subscribe to his YouTube channel. Hit that like button, comment, and let him know I sent you. Hey, he back with another one. And this one right here called Bad Times. Y'all make sure y'all tap in because I'm pretty sure we all can relate to bad times. We living in bad times. Nigga, what's up? You like half time. So, nigga, I blast nine. Push it back like a hairline. We living in bad times. You certified step. I'm the leader of this eight shit. Ever since Rollo got out of jail, he been taking shots at Boosie, and a lot of people don't get it. Yes, Rollo say he's trolling because Boosie called him a rat while he was locked up. So until Boosie allowed him to pull up and show the paperwork, he will continue to troll. During his interview with Say Cheese, they were speaking on Gotti and Dolph Beef, and something he said caught my attention. He said if he thank you a gangster, he will not troll you on the internet. So for him to troll Boosie on the internet, he have to feel like Boosie is not about his issue. But my question to y'all, do y'all think Boosie's street credit is watered down? Do y'all feel that people look at Boosie the same way they did 10 years ago? Do y'all feel like Boosie is still that boss man that we once knew and the streets respected? Y'all get in the comments and let me know. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on all post notifications. It's free. Do it for me. A lot of people do, are just wondering, where did it stem from? Do you feel like it was just plain jealousy? Um, because nobody knows how it, how, how it even got this far. You know. Do you feel like it was, it was, it was plain hatred? I mean, on their end, I feel like, if, even if it was, the, 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 the nigga Big Jook, for example, right? Yo, guy that name ain't came up in this shit, none, right? His label, CMG, shit coming up, but what I'm saying, they didn't say, yo, guy that put the $100,000 hit, and y'all, oh, yo, guy that got a lot of money. They saying Big Jook did this, right? Yo, guy that know the hustle. Yo, guy that knew from him, Dixon, 3 Six Mafia, and all the rest of these niggas, how to hustle and make money. So even if it was Dolph, 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 if it was internet beef or if it was rap beef or whatever, it, 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 money came from this You smell me? People bought into this shit. Play with me, play with your bitch. Peep, that motherfucker's on street. Like me personally, if I thought I was dealing with a real gangster, I wouldn't even be bothering that nigga on the internet. If I'm bothering a nigga on the internet, I don't feel like that nigga a gangster. I don't, I'm playing with that nigga because I don't think that nigga no gangster. There's, real gangsters don't fuck with gangsters. You smell I me? Mean? That shit automatically bondage. If you're a killer, I'm a killer. We know each other, man. I, I just don't think that it was no real super goddamn killer animosity between the nigga Dolph, I mean, to my brother Dolph, and then nigga yo got it. That's my personal opinion. You know, I think that both of them hustled and made them a whole lot of money. And then you got this old douchebag ass nigga Jook want to take the extra mile. When he should have said they put that down. Yeah. Because, I mean, just based off songs, Jook and Dolph knew each other. They had a real relationship. I mean, from what I see, I think maybe the Find out here your bitch sister, I found out here your bitch sister, huh? You still a sign, yeah. I mean, you know all that, that, but in 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 the, in the whole nutshell of money, you know, I'm thinking about the money aspect of it. God, God made a lot of money. Dolph made a lot of money. Smell me, and we got this middleman ass nigga joke in both plays up. Cause now, God got damn hot, hotter than a motherfucker. You got my boy in the, in the, in the ground like nigga like oh man he in the ground too so man i mean me personally everybody keep telling me rollo why you saying this and that you need to respect the dead 
Nigga, I don't respect everybody that's dead. I don't respect that. I think some of these need to be put in the ground. Just remember, that's just my opinion. Now everybody got down crying and shit when somebody died. But what about all this pussy ass shit this individual was doing? Oh, so we just got a Muslim brother that they just crucif just killed on motherfucking TV. Everybody knows this brother just got killed. The government did this. So obviously, I ain't the only one that feel like some people supposed to be in the ground. Although I don't think my Muslim brother supposed to be in the ground, but some of these niggas it's, it's been rude and it's low that some of these niggas need to be in the ground so don't don't i don't want the goddamn mother police in that polio oh, yeah. i'm gonna use this against rollo y'all say people supposed to be in the y'all kill the mother so some of these niggas that's in the ground i just don't believe you know i don't respect them when he got sentenced to life um you were viral for saying you wish he would have got out from say that one oh it's my nigga yeah. Oh yeah, I mean <laughs> It's time to play when you do some shit like that, like nigga. It's time to be out this motherfucker like Batman or Robin, but <laughs> it's time to get out there play that. You know, I don't believe in, you know, all that old shit. I ain't with all that getting on the stand and making sure nigga, you know, but Dolph wife wanted justice in that way, so I ain't gonna go against her. You smell me? And I love her, you smell me? And she wanted justice in that manner. That suits her. Some people believe in that. I mean, some people like law and order and shit like that. Promo alert, promo alert, promo alert. Today is Front Street Bando. Make sure y'all go follow him on Instagram. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Hit that like button. Comment and let him know I sent you. He just dropped a banger called No Trust. And when I tell y'all, you can't trust nobody, you can't trust nobody. Link will be down in the comment section. If you fell off, ain't no peace up. Let the haters hate him, make him keep it up. Felt for great for the ones don't believe in us. See him straight to your face when you speak on us. Keep it ranking, these nigga be the least for us. If you say you want smoke, tell him make it up. Living like fuck twig, gotta ink the blood. I'ma give a nigga head if he call my blow. Walk around with that stick, yeah, I'm blicked up. Do a nigga like pot trying to hit him up. Promo alert, promo alert, promo alert. Today is your boy Luckbone. Make sure you go follow him on Instagram. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Hit that like button. Comment and let him know I sent you. He just dropped the banger, man. And it's called Run It Up featuring Run Bizzle. Make sure y'all go check it out. The link will be down in the comment section. Yeah, man, what you need? Hey, what the fuck you mean what I mean, man? My business been over here for too goddamn long, man. I've been smoking the blunt, hit the cigarette and everything. I can't get my money in my motherfucking bitch, man. It's down King of the Queen, no motherfucking all machine, nigga. Ride through the city all day, I'm just getting to the pay. I'm just getting to the paper. Ride through the city all day, I give a damn about the hate. Give a damn about the hater. Run it up, run, run it up. Run. I'm just getting to the paper. Yeah. Run it up, run it up. I don't give a damn about the hater. Hey, do me a favor. Look down right there to the bottom left and hit that like button for me. Hit that like button right there. I appreciate it. I continue to watch. Promo alert. Promo alert. If you need promo, DM me on Instagram at music101ceo. $30 for one promo video on my YouTube. $50 for three promo videos on my YouTube. $70 for six promo videos on my YouTube. And $130 for 12 promo videos on my YouTube channel. Make sure y'all tap in and get that promo if you want to win.